What's up everybody, welcome back to another episode of Punch Club. Today's episode is going to be about what my typical Sunday looks like, which is my sparring day. So we're going to start from the beginning, we're going to go pretty much to the end until I get to rest and relax for the day. Um, it's about 7.30, it's waking up, made to bed, don't usually do that, but the lady's not in town, so she's not in it, and I figured if I'm going to be recording like this, you guys are going to see it, got to at least be presentable a little bit. So... Let's get right into it. We gotta go downstairs, get our water in us, and uh, get Hank out for a walk and feed him. Every morning with the water. As soon as you wake up, it just, your body needs it. It's been sleeping for so long, it hasn't had any water for eight, nine hours, whatever. Give us some water. Okay, hey, time to go potty. Come on. Come on. So getting into our walk a little bit here. We're not too far. Not yet. He'd walk all day if he could. Uh, I just want to point out, using the walk, this is when I'm going to get my Bible study in. I like to use the... There's an app called UVision, which is... Or UVersion. UVision, UVersion, I don't know. Either way, that's what I use, and it has a lot of good um, plans on there, a lot of good readings, has a daily plan, and then you can sign up for plans that are week long, month long, a year long, I'm just finishing up my year one, so just usually what I like to do, I'm out here, I'm just walking, um, listening to the Bible, you know, connecting, and disconnecting from everything else down there. Oh. Hank, what we got today? Look at that. You want that one? Oh, you want that? Just give you a little. Hank, that. You speak? Speak? Hey, how is it? I think it's gone. So typically I have to take a hang on his walk, feeding him, getting myself my breakfast, then we're on to punch club things. You know, uh, it could be YouTube, it could be TikToks, it could be writing scripts. Um, there's some announcements coming out with some new punch club things that haven't been released to you guys yet, currently in the making today. So that's what we're gonna work on for a little bit, try to get an hour's worth of work in real quick, and then uh, we're on to our workouts. Next up in our day, after we get the boxing and we get a little bit of jump rope, you know, we get warmed up, we get stretched out a little bit, get the blood flow moving and think about what we're trying to accomplish today. Next is gonna be our ice bath, which ain't much of an ice bath, that's about as much ice as I got. But that cold water still, it still messes me up. Today we're only in there for a minute. Some days I go four minutes, some days it's three minutes, it depends on the day. If it's recovery day, I'm in there longer. But with me just going sparring, I'm just looking for that initial jump to wake me up. Kind of goes with my jock. You know, it's just my routine. It gets my head in the right space. And the benefits of the ice bath to only doing it in a minute, two minutes, you know, they're different than four to five minutes. So 
do your own research. Either way, I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna do alone. I gotta hop in the shower. I like to get it warm, get warm back up, do that on and off of the cold, cold, and it's it's about blood circulation. It's about recovery, ultimately, and making sure that my body's ready to go for the day. Obviously, usually I'm gonna be in an ice bath. I ain't gonna have the shorts, but this isn't OnlyFans. This is YouTube. So. In the meantime, I hit the shower, get ready to go, relax a little bit, and make sure to have a little bit of downtime before I have to run out the door. And then it's it's off to sparring day. Just getting done at the gym here. Had a, a pretty good sparring sessions today. I mean, it, it all went very well. You guys will see 
a tenth of everything, obviously. Um, I'll probably put out a full video of some of those. I prefer to put out the full video instead of cut up. It's just makes it it can make it look one-sided and I don't want that and especially the South Pole matches you know you don't always want them to be action-packed at least where I'm at now with uh, trying to set things up you know South Pole if you watch on TV it's not gonna be like they are when you have an Orthodox match you know close versus open stance so we'll go home probably get some of these uploaded to uh, the computer get punch club up let Hank out give him a little bit of lovin's and then we have a run to complete. Not a hard run at all, it's an easy two miles at a nice, nice pace. I have to get so many hours of cardio in and Sundays seem to be a day that I'm, I'm usually open to be able to get just a little bit more time in. So, I stay, I gotta do it. Even if I feel like I got my jaw knocked off, you know? What's up, big guy? What's up, big guy? Come on. You gotta go clean your eye. I like to take Hank out, whatever else. Now it's time to refuel again. I don't get to eat a lot during the day today just because of how the hours fall. So, one scoop of this Jocko Greens, which I mean, they are absolutely amazing. Like, they just taste good. You know, they hear people like, oh, Greens drinks, that taste good, they taste like shit. Yeah, no, these, these actually taste great. Scoop of creatine. Which, all it is is the, the six star Walmart brand creatine. I'm too broke to buy any nicer stuff because I spent all my money on taco. Uh, then on top of that, Carly's not home, so I got lunch for myself. We're doing leftovers. Yeah, I made this, uh, it's like a honey glazed chicken the other night. It's amazing. I don't like to make more dishes for myself than I need to, so this is exactly how I do this. Whatever. After putting in my calories and all, uh, I realized I wasn't going to make my goals today um, if I didn't have more eggs. I need more food. So I usually I I'm eating more calories now than what I'm used to. I used to be eating less, and it's adjusting to that a little bit. But I usually don't eat a lot during the day, just little meal, little, little meal, little meal, and then at night or uh, close to dinner time, that's when I have my big meal and I have a lot of my food all at once. It's what works for me, especially with me working during the day. I don't get a chance to eat a lot unless I'm working from home that day, which is uh, it's only two days a week. So we got Hank out, we got food, so now next is to. Get the phone plugged in the computer. We get all the videos right on the computer and save the memory on my phone. And then I like to watch the videos, the sparring videos that I did right after. It's just, my mind is still fresh at that point. So it's it's nice to be able to look over and be like, okay, I was trying to do this and I messed this up, or at least I know what I was thinking at that point instead of watching it a week later. So that's what we're getting into now. <laughs> guys that's it that's my Sunday sparring day routine it's coming up about 4 35 o'clock right now so this is usually when I'm like okay I gotta wrap up whatever I'm working on it's time for me to put it to the side and make sure I have some time to sit relax you know have some fun whether it be watch a show I've been wanting to watch or sit down with Carly she's not home yet she's out of town but she'll be here in a little bit and we'll have time for the rest of the day just to sit relax uh, spend some time with Hank, eat her dinner, and, you know, just take in life. You know, smell the roses a little bit instead of just go, 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 go. So you saw pretty much from my beginning, my wake up, my routine, from getting my breakfast in, you know, getting to my first workout, getting punch club done. Sometimes I might throw some schoolwork in with that. It depends on the day. There are differences. 
Like, I'm not always gonna take Hank on my run afterwards. It just seemed like today would be a good day. It's nice out. It hasn't been that nice here in Pennsylvania recently, so if there's a day like this, I gotta get him out. And it was, an, it was a nice, slow, just steady pace run. It's just about getting that blood flow going and being able to stretch afterwards and prepare my body for the next training day. Which, tomorrow is Monday. I do have my active recovery that I do, you know, light cardio again working through some boxing stuff so just throwing some techniques out there um honing the skills a little bit but not getting the heart rate really up that much and doing all that so that i can stretch my muscles out roll my muscles out and get ready for tuesday because tuesday ramps back up and then thursday after class you know i have class at night and then i have training friday morning train most of the day friday and then saturday i have training and then Sunday is sparring, and the weekend's where my, my days pick up, so my body is, feels pretty dragged out by then, so. I hope to see that you like this video, and hopefully you hit that thumbs up icon. Make sure to subscribe if you want to keep up with me, or have some boxing insights, some tips, tricks, place if you want to learn, if you want some motivation, or you just want to see my journey, that's what you can do, all three there. Make sure you keep up with Punch Club Media on TikTok and on Instagram. You can't end a video without saying it. Thank you for watching Punch Club.